Om Shanti, today is your 152nd day of your Godly Blessing. And before we go ahead, there's a reminder that the link above is going to direct you towards the yoga asanas and different methods of keeping your body healthy. And even sleep management, many more things are mentioned up there. And even your eating habits. So have a look up there. And let's go ahead with this today's blessing. Let's see what Baba says in today's blessing. He tries to tell us that we have to develop one method, just like a royal person, a king, or a prime minister or a president first gets his food checked and then he accepts the food. Similarly, here the thoughts, the food for thought is something which we need to check. God says you are a royal child of mine. So you act like one and you check your thoughts and then only put them into actions. So let's see what Baba has to tell us in details over here. Baba says in today's blessing, may you make the speciality of checking a deep sanskars. May you make the speciality of checking a deep sanskars of yours. So we have to make this habit a deep habit that we check first what we are thinking and then check before we speak and check before we act into it. So make your, may you make the speciality of checking a deep sanskar of yours, your own and become a great soul. So that's the method of becoming a great soul. Otherwise, we, without checking, if we think and say and do, then our karmas become impure and then automatically our vibrations become impure and people don't like us. God, obviously, he's nobody who says that I don't like you, I don't love you because you've done this thing, but he always forgives us. But in our own eyes and in other people's eyes, we become somebody who's a sinner. So let's go into detail. says whatever thoughts you have words you speak actions you perform thoughts words and actions you perform and connections and relationships you come into simply check are these equal to those of the father so we have to check we are God's child like a child always checks from his father dad mom should I do this is this right is this correct so same similarly over here whether you call him a dad or a mom father or a mother it doesn't matter because soul is genderless supreme soul is genderless it doesn't have a physical body only when we have a physical body i'll say i'm a man or a woman so god says think of yourself as a soul my soul my child and then think will god think like this will god talk like this will god act like this if he was in my place so that's the method so then baba says are these equal to the father those of the father or not check them first first of all compare them and then make them practical compare it will God in my place do this think like this act like this check it and then only get into action so first of all compare them and then make them practical put them into practice later on first check them generally some souls also first of all have the sanskar of checking everything before accepting just like a president prime minister even kings they used to have somebody Used to taste if they used to go for any kind of dawat or somebody's uh, used somebody used to ask them to come over for a party or any kind of function they used to first get that person to taste the food and then only they used to accept it and many more other things used to be done so that they are safe and protected so here we have to be safe and protected from doing bad karmas so god says check will god in my place think like this if god was there in my place will he speak like this if God was in my place, will he act like this? And then only get into practicality or do it in a practical way, that karma. Thought is also karma, God says. Words also karma and your actions also karma. So God says in the same way, you are pure and great souls. Don't forget that. When we forget that we are God's children, we think I am so much so-and-so's child, so-and-so person's child I am. And then we think that I am from so-and-so religion or I am from so-and-so caste or creed or from so-and-so sect and then we think that okay we forget that we are God's children we forget the royalty and we forget what kind of habits we should have and we start copying those other sanskars which are not 100% pure like God the Father so we have to think like that that's what we learn in Brahma Kumaris and then throughout the day do the right actions with the right thoughts and with the right words and then God says in the same way you are pure and great souls don't forget that and so intensify your machinery of checking just like when we feed put a feed into the machinery 
that machinery will start making the bread or the biscuits or many other things quickly right he also God says speed up this is the knowledge which I given you apply it into your mind's machine put it into your mind on a daily basis apply it think speak and act before you check it with God the Father that means will God do it if he was in my place so do that and put it into machinery quickly don't do it tomorrow I'll think about it or I'll do it in the evening no right now itself think it right now put it into practice right now so that your karmas become lighter and your mind becomes more peaceful and less jumbled up let's go ahead again Baba says so intensify your machinery of checking make this a deep sanskar of yours your own sanskar and this is greatness God says when you put this into practice then you will be called as a great soul because your karmas will be lighter your thoughts will be lighter your words will be lighter your actions will be light and people will love it so think about it contemplate about it and put it into action so I leave you with this beautiful blessing have a blessed day Om Shanti Thank you.